More on our top story now. The UAE and Israel opening diplomatic relations, forming a peace agreement and a future of trade. It was announced by President Trump earlier today. The deal, the UAE becomes the first Gulf nation to, to normalise relations with Israel. The, the opportunities are vast for bilateral trade and investment. John Medved joins me now from Jerusalem, the founder of Out, um, Our Crowd, a platform that connects investors to basically investors to, to ideas, startups, and innovation. And um, John, how long before you make your first trip to Abu Dhabi or Dubai, where there are vast sources of funds for you to tap into? Oh, well, I, I hate to tell you, uh, Richard, but it's actually not going to be my first trip. It will be my first trip, perhaps, on my Israeli passport. But I was in uh, Abu Dhabi just a year ago, and uh, you could tell this was coming. I was in Dubai about two years ago. These are processes that have been going on, not in the public eye, but it's been clear that this is what we were leading to, and this is absolutely a historic moment. Right. So where's the benefit commercially as you see it? Well, what we're doing um, is essentially going to connect the unbelievably interesting investor community of the Gulf led by UAE, but my intent and my, my sense is that the Saudis and others will follow Bahrainis and whatnot with the incredible energy represented by Israel's startup nation. You know that Israel is probably the second most important source of innovative startup companies in the world after Silicon Valley. This year, about $10 billion will be invested in Israeli startups. Our crowd is the biggest investor in Israel. And the investors over there are hungry for these deals, and we are going to work with them on them. And the UAE, things like Mubadala and the like, they themselves have huge talent resources in technology that, when fused with what Israel has in joint ventures, not just money, but actually scholastic and environmental joint ventures, will be huge. This is going to be really fundamentally changing the world for the better. I mean, today we don't get a lot of good news when we look around the planet, except this is just unadulterated, wonderful news. I don't care where your politics are at, who you are, you got to celebrate this. This is the third Arab country making a full peace normalization with Israel. It's a very special country, very progressive, very advanced, looking towards the future. And this is about the good guys winning on, on all sides. And it's, I think, really a, a time to celebrate and get to work. John? John, I believe you've got some celebratory news yourself within your family tonight, which is also good news. Loads of good news. And mazel tov to you uh, on that. Uh, thank you, John Medford, joining me uh, from... Um, from